The governor of Lagos State, Babajide Sonwolu, on Saturday reopened the Apongbo Bridge in the state over 15 months after a fire outbreak at the market and its environment. Road users and motorists around the area were thrown into panic on the 23rd of March when an early morning fire broke out at a Pogba market destroying several wooden shops. Vehicles parked on the, the bridge were also raised by the inferno, which enveloped a large section of the bridge. Following the fire outbreak, the Lagos state government shut the Eco Bridge with alternative routes announced for diverting traffic and for the safety of motorists. This is to formally let all our citizens, especially users of the Akongo end of the Eco Bridge, that after a very extensive repair work that the Federal Ministry of Works had embarked upon in collaboration and with support from the Lagos State Government. We have seen the effects of a collaborative effort. A lot of you would have wanted this to happen earlier than now, but because of the extent of work that has to be done on the bridge, because of the extent of the destruction that happened on the bridge, we cannot take the risk to have opened it earlier before now. And so, it's with great delight that we have done a comprehensive test with the contractors from Federal Ministry of Works, and we believe that this end, this portion of Akongbo of the Cobridge, Bridge, will now be fit for motorists. Like has been said, the work has not ended. This part has been completed, but the work on the entire bridge has not been completed. There are lots of other bearings that still has to be done on the entire stretch of the bridge going all the way to Alaka. So what the Federal Ministry of Works have worked with us is that in future there will be closure but very, very short closure. Very, very short closure that probably will not be more than a week, two weeks or three weeks at different sections so that they can jack up the bridge the other part of it and complete it. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.